What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at interesting haircuts. This is part 3. If you haven't seen part 1 and part 2, you need to go watch those because those are hilarious and I'm guaranteeing you you're going to get a laugh from them. If you are not already, take this time to subscribe, turn on that bell for notifications, and drop a like on this video. Let's get started. This first one we have, it looks like this guy has Wi-Fi what? in the back of his head. I'm sure you can't get an internet connection if you hold your phone up to it like... Or, or something. I mean, if you can, that's that's cool, man. Like you, you're in the future. You're in the future. Visible confusion. Who else thought? Who thought? Whoever thought? Who thought that you could get Wi-Fi on the back of your head? Bruh. Follow him for free Wi-Fi. So I'm assuming that it does have free Wi-Fi on there. I'm thinking he got some inspiration from those workout shirts that have that similar pattern on there. Now, I'm sure the shirts don't have Wi-Fi, but I mean, if shirts had Wi-Fi, everybody would have Wi-Fi. Wouldn't have to worry about not having it because everybody would have Wi-Fi. Moving on to the next one, we have a croissant or crescent. This is not really a haircut, but it's a hairstyle, so I guess we can put that in here. This is interesting. I'm not sure why she did that, but I mean, if that's you, go ahead and rock it. Cause I can't say nothing. I can't say nothing. Cause compared to that guy before, Wi-Fi. I mean, if you can get Wi-Fi off the back of your head, off of your kitchen, as some people will call it, then by all means, go ahead and get that. Because Wi-Fi is already too expensive. And crescent, croissant. More visible confusion. Okay, we really have to find out what the difference between a crescent and a croissant is because I'm starting to get confused. But if you want to wear that on your head, then go ahead. That's your style. Rock it. Own it. Don't let anybody talk about you. If they do, then they don't even matter because it's your head. It's not their head. So remember that. What do you want? Sharpie me up, fam. <laughs> um, don't do that. That better not be a sharpie. Just get something else, man. A Sharpie is not meant for your head. A Sharpie is meant to take notes and to write on stuff and to make business decisions. Visible irritation. <laughs> I mean, I guess your head can be a business decision, your business decision, but I don't think Sharpie goes on your head. Another thing too, if that's Sharpie, you could have at least brought your hairline up a little bit more if that's really Sharpie. What? <laughs> Look at the top of his head! See? I don't think you thought about that. You look like you thought about everything else. Thought about it so much that it went back there. But... Oh! Anyways, on to the next one. Here this guy looks like he's about to go to Super Saiyan. He's ready to fight Broly, or Vegeta, or Cell, or the androids. He's ready to fight. He's obviously tapped into this kind of power before, and we don't have to. Worry about him derailing the train. It looks like he's in a train or a bus or anything like that because he's already ready. Because sometimes when you just got it, you got it. You don't even have to over exaggerate and yell or make it to where they can hear you all the way in Texas or something like that or wherever you live. You just got it like that, I assume. I actually have a friend I know that can go super sane. <laughs> Anyways, on to the next hairstyle. Okay, here we have hands covering her face. This looks like a, some creepy Halloween stuff. I, I feel a little uncomfortable looking at that. Like, that's scary. Or maybe whatever they were talking about, she didn't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Maybe that's what she was going for. Maybe she didn't intend for it to look as creepy as it was. But on to the next one. How can I help you today? I don't know, man. Something new. I try to keep an open mind. Say no more. Up to your senses. An open mind? That ain't right. What do you want? I don't know. It's always hard for me to choose between two things. Say no more. Now this can actually have you looking like two different people. You turn to the side. Hey, I'm Wolverine. Hey, I'm Aang from Avatar. What kind of cut do you want? Ever seen the moon before? Say no more. Wow, that's that's truly unique. That's truly unique. I've never seen the moon on someone's head. Your beard, man, that's beard gold right there. I mean, if they make a DreamWorks movie, they can just put his head on there, right? Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, next one. We're going to the next one because I can't with that. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching. Okay, no. You guys know from previous videos I'm not a fan of these type of hairstyles. We've seen, I think maybe with the first or the second one, the guy had eyes on the back of his head and then he had something similar to this on the back of his neck and that really creeped me out. The fact that he put his glasses on top of his head doesn't make it any better, man. I mean, he must not know how he looks. <laughs> or maybe he does, but he just doesn't care. That's actually not a tattoo, that's actually his haircut. The guy before was a tattoo, but this guy actually has like eyebrows and eyes and a nose cut within the hair on his head. Can you honestly say that you can look at this and not get creeped out? Don't do that! Because I definitely can. Thank you guys for watching this video. Down in the description will be links to channels I would like you to subscribe to. Subscribe to DPR. Subscribe to Moonhouse. Subscribe to my friend Bree. Who are you? A new series is coming soon. Make sure you go watch the trailer. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching, yeah.